morning, this is Bob Mason from FX Empire and welcome to the daily crypto tech review of Bitcoin, Ethereum, Litecoin and Ripple's XRP. We'll be looking at the MACDs, the moving averages and the day's support resistance and pivot levels. It is Wednesday the 10th of February. Jumping straight into Bitcoin against the US dollar, look at the hourly candlesticks. Being a choppy start to the morning, then you see Bitcoin avoid a fall back through the pivot at 46.6208 to take a run at the first major resistance level, saying at 48.157. Then you see support from the broader market for Bitcoin to break back through to 48,000 levels, however. So, barring an extended rally on day, expect that first major resistance level and Tuesday's new swing high, 48,277, to cap any upside. In the event of an extended rally, you could see Bitcoin test resistance at 50,000 before any pullback. Second major resistance level is at 49,825. A fallback through the pivot would bring the first major support level at 44,940 into play, buying an extended itself on the day. Bitcoin should stay clear of the second major support level at 43,391. Looking at the MACD, we've got a slight narrowing of the bearish histogram, but nothing indicative of a bullish morning ahead, so I need to keep an eye on that. On the EMA, 50 has moved away marginally from the 100 and the 200, supporting this early morning upside. So key through the early part of the day, avoid a fallback through the pivot at 46.608 and break back through to 48,000 levels to bring resistance levels into play. Failure to do that and support levels will be in play. Moving across to Ethereum against the US dollar, it's a positive start to the day. Going to need to Ethereum, avoid a fallback through the pivot at 17.69. Take a run at the first major resistance levels in 18.28. Going to need to support from the broader market for Ethereum to break out from yesterday's new swing high. 1824.23. So, barring an extended rally on day, expect that first major resistance level and the swing high to cap any upside. In the event of an extended rally, could see Ethereum test resistance at 1900 before any pullback. Second major resistance level sits at 1883. Fallback through the pivot would bring the first major support level at 1713 into play. Barring an extended sell off on the day, Ethereum should still well clear of sub 1600. Second major support level at 1655 to limit the downside. On the EMAs, we're seeing a marked narrowing of the bearish histograms, and we could see a possible bullish cross there. So keep an eye on that at the early part of the day. On the EMA, the 50 has pulled away marginally from the 100 and the 200, supporting the early upside. So keep through the early part of the day, avoid the pivot at 1769, and break back through to 1800 levels to bring resistance levels into play. Moving across to Litecoin against the US dollar, choppy start to the day. Going to need to see Litecoin avoid a fall through the pivot at 176.95 to take a run at the first major resistance level, saying at 189.68. Going to need to see support from the broader market for Litecoin to break out from January the 10th, swing high 186.34. So, barring an extended rally on the day, expect that first major resistance level and resistance at 190 to cap any upside. In the event of an extended rally, you could see Litecoin test resistance at 200 before any pullback. Second major resistance level sits at 197.43. Fall through the pivot would bring the first major support level set at 169.2 into play. Barring an extended sell on the day, Litecoin shifts is well clear of sub 160. Second major support level sits at 156.47. Looking at the MACD, we've got a widening of the bullish histogram indicating a bullish morning ahead. On the EMA, we're also seeing the 50 move away marginally from the 100 and the 200, also a bullish signal. So keep through the early part of the day, avoid the pivot at 176.95. Break back through yesterday's high at 184.71 to bring resistance levels into play. Failure to do that and support levels will be in play. Finally, looking at Ripple's XRP against the US dollar, bullish start to the day here. Going to need to see Ripple's XRP avoid the pivot. At 0.4725 to take a run at the first major resistance level, saying at 0.4954. Going to need to see support from the broader market for Ripple's XRP to break out from yesterday's high, 0.49092. So, barring an extended rally on day, expect that first major resistance level and resistance at 0.5 to cap any upside. In the event of an extended rally, could see Ripple's XRP test resistance at 0.55 before any pullback. Second major resistance level. So it's a 0.5139. A fall through the pivot would bring the first major support level at 0.4540 into play.
buying an extended sell off on the day. Ripples XRP should still well clear of the second major support level. It's an 8.4310. Looking at the MACD, we've got a bullish cross this morning, supporting this early morning upside. On the EMA, the 50 has pulled away from the 100 and the 200, also a bullish signal. So key through the early part of the day, avoid a fallback through the pivot at 0.4725 and break back through to 0.49 levels to bring resistance levels into play. Failure to do that and support levels will come into play.